just like father figure to all of us. And a lot of us are away from home, so having him and just knowing we could go to him with absolutely anything, like whether it's somehow we got in trouble or school's tough or whatever it is, he'll be there and just he just loves us for who we are. Uh, congratulations on all American honors. Uh, <laughs> what does that mean to you? It's pretty cool. I get a tree next to Joey's. So. <laughs> is that what it is? You already trees. have the spot? Yeah, we already got the spot. <laughs> um, yeah, it's pretty awesome. Get the first team. Is that something that you and Joey have talked about, getting the tree together next to each other? No, but um, now that it happened, we definitely talk about it a little bit. What, to, what do you think you showed people to, to put yourself in that position that people regard you as one of the best defensive linemen in college football? I just think none of us really got as many reps as other players did who across the country, but we just made the most of our reps. And, and going against our offensive line, I think, is what really allowed me to be as good because they, they don't go easy on you any day, so they force you to just find new ways to get better every single day. As you're getting into this preparation for USC, um, what do you see out of what they can do offensively with their quarterback? He's a pretty good player. Just uh, how important is it going to be for this defensive line to play one of its best games? I guess? Uh, we're going to have to help out our um, our DBs and our linebackers because they have a really good running back. We're definitely one of the best we've played right up there with Saquon. And uh, we're not taking any of them lately, obviously, the quarterbacks going to be a top pick, so uh, we just have to help those guys out because their skill positions are really good and it'll be some of the best we've seen. Nick, if, if you could go to the NFL right now, and you can, would you be ready? I think I would, but an extra year of uh, development is really important and uh, I think I'll be a lot more ready next year. How? Because obviously, again, you're winning awards. You've had a really good year. Where do you think you can get better? Everything. I'm not even close to where I could be. Just every day I'm looking for something to get better. I watched film on Joey. He, he went from freshman year. I watched his freshman, sophomore, junior film, and the biggest jump he made was the year from sophomore to junior year. Uh, the stats weren't the same, obviously, because he's getting triple teamed and everybody know, knew who he was, but uh, the jump he made as a player is what is why he's doing what he's doing right now. Are you expecting to be triple teamed next year? I mean, you saw that. I'm sure they'll, they'll be there, but with uh, Coop and Chase on the other side and Draymond hopefully come back, um, and then BB inside, it'll be tough to double team anyone. Are you working do you on think, do you think you'll get more reps next year? I mean, yeah. we see we see the guys who are going to be gone. I'm going to get a lot of reps. So are you looking for, I mean, again, we've talked about it a million times this year. You guys have a great rotation. We know it keeps you guys fresh. But is there a part of you that's looking forward to it? Oh, yeah, I want to play every meaningful play in the game. And I've always wanted to do that. But just having, I mean, I've gotten everything I've wanted personally. And just seeing the success of my teammates is, makes it even better. For you personally, do you kind of view, and I know you're just wrapping your second season here, are you going to be a leader on this team in, in 2018? What's, what's your thought about that and, and what goes with being a leader? I think a little more vocal. I'll have to be a little more vocal next year. So we're going to have a lot of young guys and a lot of guys who haven't played in the games yet. So I think I lead by example already, but just taking the vocal pushing guys. I've already gotten with Chase a lot, trying to help him out. Um, so yeah, just getting a little more vocal is going to be important. So we know how good these defensive ends were, but you mentioned it. You, Chase, Coop. Can you be better. as good, even better? Yeah, we can. How? Explain. We're going to be really good. I mean, just having Chase along with Coop. Just, I'm sure they'll be rotating, and I just think the pass rush is going to be really, because we're all sp really specialists in pass rush, and um, Draymond is going to finally get some third down reps in the nickel package, and he's one of the best pass rushers I've ever seen in practice, so people really haven't seen that aspect of his game, 
and he's he's fun to watch. So it's gonna be it's gonna be fun. Yeah, what Why? Just I don't know. I mean, it's hard, you know. I mean, it's so. talented. Just because he guys. hasn't been able to showcase his pass rush yet, and when he does, the nation's gonna be like, all right, we're taking him.